And here they are, Pacing's big three of Philly and two Colts. Leading the way to the post is Phantom Lady. The odds against her winning are three to one. Adios Harry, next in line is the public choice at the prohibitive rate of two to five. Behind him is Queen's Adios, also a three to one shot. These three are all that are left from among 759 standard breads that were nominated to the Little Brown Jug as yearlings, and in a short while, two of them are going to fall by the wayside. Only three of them behind that gate now, and once again, it's Eddie O'Sherry bursting out on top with Queen's Eddie O's on the outside. Queen's Eddie O's tries briefly to make the front and then drops back to third behind Phantom Lady. Eddie O'Sherry still leads. Around the turn, it's the same order with Adios Harry setting pretty much his own pace. That last half mile to go, and still no change in the order. Last time down the back stretch now, and in a moment you'll begin to see them open up for the final drive. There, Jim Hackett is first out with Queen's Adios, and Phantom Lady goes to the clip is tremendous. Around the final turn they roll in a symphony of speed with Eddie O'Sherry maintaining his lead under stout pressure. Through the lane, it's Eddie O'Sherry just as he pleases. He's going easily as the others try desperately to catch up, but they can't do it today. It's Eddie O'Sherry all the way. Time for the mile is two, two, and three fifths, and Addy O'Sherry pays $2.80 to win. And here he comes, back to the winner's circle, with the flower bearers and the blanket holders ready to greet him. The little brown jug blanket is displayed, and Joe Neville congratulates on her lions and his son, and poses with them for the photographer. Portrait of a great pacing champion, Adios Harry, winner of the 1954 Little Brown Jug. Owner Lions and sponsor Neville stand with the winner who collected better than $26,000 for his afternoon's work. And now the new champ leaves the circle and heads back for the barn. It's been a tough day for Adios Harry, but he made it look easy. As his owner said in the winner's circle, too bad he was a little bit off or he'd really have shown you something. Man, oh man, he must be something when he's right. That's a real racehorse, that one. A champion from the word go.